Hi there everyone, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps. We're going to be using one of our new stamps and one of our older stamps. They're designed so that they do work well together so you can mix and match. Okay, I'm going to give the background first of all of our multifarious card um, a wash using the brushos. So I've got my fan brush here and I'm going to be picking up it's a really nice sort of green so we're gonna these are really watered down and then we're adding some of the Prussian blue as well now I'm going to start drying this off but then adding a little bit of water as I go along which gives us just a really nice effect and it just blends those two colours together. Okay, so dry that off and always mop that little bit up with the kitchen towel as well let's give that a little bit of a, a wiggle to get back into shape That's what's good about the Multifarious card, it's a, it's a really thick card, so I think it's a three, 320 I think it is, um, so it's, it holds its shape really well. Next up I'm going to use our Blackberry stamp and I'm inking this up in the Nocturne. Now it's a really detailed stamp this, so just when you pop it down onto your card, just make sure that you leave it rest a while. Let that ink soak in. As I say, we've got all that lovely detail, so we don't want to take the stamp off too soon. There we go. I'm going to now ink up in the twilight. I'm going to take that first impression off and then bob that down alongside. And I'll do the same on the other side. So stamp off and then we're just going to put a little bit more down the side of the card like so and it just creates such a pretty background that does. So we've got our mini blackberry here. So I'm going to pop that down on a block, I'm inking up in the twilight and go that way around I think and I'm just popping that round about there and again I'm going to do another one and this time leaning up against the other I'm going to pop that round about there like so I'm taking our mask I'm just going to pop that on the edge there and then using a stencil brush I'm just going to ground It's 
going to ground them like so. And now we're going to add one of our older stamps. These come in a pack of three. And these are our little mice. So I'm inking him up in black in the Nocturne. Make sure it's completely covered. And then I'm going to pop that mouse on top of the blackberry, like so. And there he is. Now we've got a little bit of foliage here as well, so I'm going to do a little bit hanging down. I use this so often now. You know, when you've got one of your favourite stamps, you just use it on everything. Well, this is mine at the moment, anyway. I've got a little bit of a mark here, so I'm going to see if I can disguise that. There we go. I've got Monarch here. I'm going to use my stencil brush and I'm just going to go around the edge. I feel like with them being blackberries, I just wanted a little bit of purple in there as well. Okay, next thing we're going to, let's have a think, we're going to use some glitter. So we're going to need our glue pen and we're just going to bob the glue pen over the foliage, just dotting. Let's go with this one, Purple Delight. And all I'm going to do is just sprinkle that over the top. Let's pop that glitter back in the pot before I forget. There we have our card. I hope you can see that lovely glitter again. I think the purple works well. Well, thanks so much guys for joining me today. You take care and we'll see you real soon.